Hey guys, TCOM13 here, and welcome back to some more Let's Play Devil Survivor 2 Record Breaker. In the last episode, we defeated the next mysterious invader, Merak, with relative ease, actually, because my demons are actually quite good. <laughs> uh, in this episode, we're probably just gonna wrap up day two, do a couple more of the, uh, fate links, or whatever the fuck they're called in this game. So, uh, let's get started with that. Let's start with, uh... Actually, let's start with Yamato's event, the public. Yamato is staring at a gyps agent with his cold gaze. We're getting reports of tremendous civilian casualties. There are more demons than expected. I see. Yes? Well, I believe there is a need for increased defenses. More defenses? Why? Huh? Well, the civilians, sir. What do we gain by taking that extra risk? Well... Why waste time saving all the incompetents? It won't help our tactical situation. It will only speed up the process that is killing Japan. Am I wrong? No, sir, but... Dismissed, Agent. I'm busy. S sorry, Chief Otsuin. When the agent bows and marches out, Yamato glances in your direction. Ah, it's you. The situation is as you've heard. Listening to our emotions and saving everyone we can would be easy. We aren't blind to this. However, doing so would diminish our own forces, and we'd only have more incompetence to show for it. Do you understand? We must have priorities, unlike Japan before. So Gyps is a priority. It requires more explanation than that. What Japan needs now are people who can use demons, and people who can defeat them. Those are the only people worth saving. People like you. Well then, dismissed. Yamato turns his back turns back to his work. Did I screw up there? I think I was supposed to get a rank up. Uh hold on. Okay, so that changed nothing. Cool. So I still have zero rank with Yamato. That's fucking fantastic. Uh alright, let's uh let's go to EO. Boisterous woman is talking to Eo. Hey, you! What are you doing there? Huh? Me? You can't stay here. Monsters will get you. Actually, I have the summoning app, so you have to get to the shelter. N no, like I was saying. You can stay in my house. One more girl ain't gonna hurt. But the woman takes Eo by the arm and begins dragging her away. Just then, Eo catches sight of you. I um. Huh, oh. Huh? What do you want? <laughs> She's my friend. Well, why didn't you say that in the first place? S sorry. The woman, re the woman releases Eo. I'll be going then. Feel free to stop on by if you're ever in trouble, alright? Of course. Um, thank you. <laughs> thank you, too. You've come to my rescue yet again. I was scared. But her heart was in the right place. No one in Tokyo would try and help other people. I think I'm gonna like Osaka. Yo and Yo leave the area together. Yo is gazing out with a determined look on her face. What's wrong, Yo? Oh, I I'm sorry. I was lost in thought. Yo is unexpectedly flustered. Um, I was just thinking about the battle. Oh, with Merak? Yeah. Not only that, but the one we fought in Tokyo yesterday. Dubei. Um, don't you feel like we should recognize those names from somewhere? Oh, hey guys! What's with the astronomy talk? Seems Hinako happened to be passing by. Astronomy talk? Well, you were just talking about Dubei and Merak, weren't you? H Hinako, could you explain that a little? My pleasure. Okay, other than Dubé and Merak, there's Facta and... Hmm, what else? You know, all those Ursa Majory stars. You're right. Oh, did you know that already? I thought it was common knowledge. It is the Big Dipper, after all. So, there are seven stars in total. Mm-hmm. What exactly were you two talking about? 
Um, well, you see... Eo explains about Dubay and Merak. Oh, I get it. Those monsters are named after the Big Dipper stars, huh? It seems so. Those are just the names that came from the summoning app, though. All we know about them now is that they're not quite like the other demons. Oh, no, no, no! This is an incredible find! If whoever made the app didn't know anything, their names wouldn't be listed, right? I doubt the names were assigned randomly. That can only mean one thing. Or a few things. Five, to be precise. Mm-hmm. Only five more to go. Hey, this is just a thought, but... Could monsters like Jubei and Merak have something to do with the disasters? I suppose it's possible. Yeah, we discovered here in Osaka that the earthquakes weren't the real cause, so... If something else triggered those disasters, I thought they'd be a natural candidate. Maybe. It seems like there are five more still to come, so I bet this isn't over yet. Y yeah but it's better than being completely in the dark. Absolutely. Good detective work, guys. I'll report it to Jips for you. Okay. Thanks. I'll let Daichi and Joe know, too. I guess we should get going? Oh, and hey. Th thanks for keeping me company. Leave the area with Eo. Alright, back to Tokyo. You arrive at the special Gyps platform to return to Tokyo. I can't believe that was just one day. I'm totally wiped. <laughs> We've got another big day tomorrow. I guess so. At least we learned some stuff in Osaka. I think we made some progress. You got a point. I got my pants scared off, but it was worth the trip. If we'd stayed in Tokyo, we'd have learned a whole lot of nothing. I think we're getting the hang of dealing with demons, too. Maybe the government can't do much, but we can rest easier knowing Gyps is fighting hard. Hey. Oh, hey, Kata. There you are. We came to see you off. And Hinako. Hi, Hinako. And Kata, you came just for us? Of course. We're friends now. Kata didn't want to miss saying goodbye, right? <laughs> you dragged me here. Oh, yeah? Then <laughs> what's that in your hand? Here... Kata slowly reaches out to offer something to you. A souvenir? Yeah, it's for you. You take the Ikiyaki Yokan from Kata. Too bad one of you guys has to cut the trip short at Nagoya, huh? The sorry, come again? <laughs> Second it. Are you serious? Who's going to Nagoya? You haven't heard? Kata! You forgot to tell them, didn't you? Shut up! I'll tell him now! What are we going for? I don't know, supply run or something? Hmm... I wonder why we have to make the trip so suddenly. Hmm. Hey, you! You're from the West originally, yeah? Kata looks back at Joe. Who, me? Not gonna happen, sister. Me and Nagoya don't see eye to eye. What's going on, Joe? Oh, you didn't understand my Japanese? Maybe it's my accent. God damn it, Joe. It seems Joe is not eager to go to Nagoya. Okay then, I'll go. Pick me. You're unexpectedly eager though, Daichi. Why do you want to go, Daichi? <laughs> Someone's eager. <laughs> have you forgotten so soon? I have a driver's license. God damn it, I fucking love Ben Diskin's delivery. It's so good. <laughs> I can drive a supply truck all over the place. Besides, what are the chances I'll have to fight demons while transporting supplies? We're counting on you, Daichi. Awesome. I've got the need for speed! Uh, a safe speed, of course. Under the speed limit. Don't want to get a ticket. <laughs> <laughs> I've been thinking. We came all the way down oh, here and man. totally took down Merak. We might actually have a shot at this. So that's why I want to be more, you know, proactive about helping out and stuff. Well, good luck. You just watch. I'll make myself all kinds of useful. So Daichi's going to Nagoya? I'll let him know. Oh, looks like you're leaving soon. 
You should hop on the train. Bye for now. Thanks for everything. No, thank you. Goodbye. Come back and visit. We'll be waiting for you. Later, idiots. Work hard and maybe you'll survive. Don't sweat the small stuff, buddy. See you in Tokyo. Don't worry. I got this. I'll show you what a Daichi can do. Go for it, man. Bye, guys. I'll bring you some souvenirs. All right. Guess that's it for the day. Hello, Master. Your hard work today is to be commended. I have taken the liberty of composing a simple summary of your actions today. Would you care to hear it? Uh, please. Understood. Well then, let me begin. After awakening, you met with Mistress Makoto. She explained how Gyps came upon the rituals for demon summoning, and then adopted the more recent application. This summoning application, you see, was prepared by us at Nicaea. I wonder if they can master it. Your friends, Master Daichi and Mistress Io, headed out to investigate their homes. Unfortunately, Mistress Io's home was in ruins. Please extend my condolences. Neither your home nor Master Daichi's could be reached. Do you believe the organization known as Gyps truly has your best interests at heart? Later, you helped Mistress Makoto fend off those ruffians who were misusing the demon summoning application. You must understand, the use of our demon summoning application is entirely up to the wielder. Used by the wicked, it is a poisoned blade. Used by the just, it is a bold aegis. Either is possible where mankind is concerned. Its use is of no consequence to us. Next, you and your companions visited Osaka and viewed Master Kata's death video. You stopped by the festival gate at Master Joe's suggestion. There, you entered into battle with an unusual girl who traveled with demons. No doubt you had your reasons, but have you considered that she might be right to keep their company? I wonder how you'd feel to know the answer. You then met Mistress Hinako at Ebisu Bridge and together journeyed to save Master Kata. I was pleased to learn that you made use of our unique services to prevent Master Kata's untimely demise. Afterwards, you visited the Gyps' headquarters. There, Mistress Hinako was granted full membership in their organization. I wonder, will Gyps truly be able to provide her with what she seeks? You were given an opportunity to witness the damage done to Osaka with your own eyes. The leader of Gyps, Yamato Hotsuin, informed you of the unprecedented disaster that has struck this world. He showed you images of each city they had succeeded in contacting. The extent of the devastation came as a great shock to you and your compatriots. Finally, you encountered and ended battle with Merak at Atsuten Kaku. A splendid showing, Master, as you emerged victorious. Well done. According to Mistress Hinako, the names of the strange creatures you have fought align with the stars of the Big Dipper. If that is the case, must you fight the remaining ones as well? This concludes my overview of the day's events. May your tomorrow be a nice day as well. Alright, let's see. Thanks, for this. Thanks so much for today. You were a big help. If only things weren't so bad, I'd show you around my Osaka. I wish you could try the pork buns from 155. They're so good. Well, I'll hold down the fort here in Osaka. You do the same in Tokyo. Thanks for everything today. I'll pay you back. Thanks, Kata. Alright, uh, so let's save. And yeah, we're gonna keep going because we're only at 15 minutes. And we're not gonna end the video that early. The third day. Tuesday's disquiet.
You spend the night at the Gyps Tokyo branch. I'm coming in. <gasps> Pervert. P Pervert? No, that's not what I was trying to do. I rushed in because I was in a hurry to tell you something. Perhaps I've lived at Gyps for so long I might lack certain normal niceties. Makoto hesitates. What's this about? In any case, we... We lost contact with Shijima in Nagoya last night. In fact, not just him. We can't raise anyone at the Nagoya branch. We suspect that there's some kind of problem. What kind of problem? I wish I had more information for you. Unfortunately, we can't dedicate resources to an investigation. Our hands are full dealing with unsealed demons. I'll go and investigate. You want to go to Nagoya? <sighs> Let me be frank. I was ordered to send you and your friends to investigate Nagoya. In truth, I'd rather not see you kids get any more involved. <laughs> A few days too late for that. <laughs> True enough. Please, I'd like you to head to Nagoya to investigate. Take me to Anakie with you. Consider it done. Thank you. I promise we'll send reinforcements the moment we can spare them. Meet me at Shinbashi around 8. I'll have a train prepared for you. Makoto leaves the room. Oh, email. Uh, let's see what we got. Oh, the compendium. Good. Alright, so yeah, you can just... Sa same as overclocked, you can just resummon demons that you've had before. If you register your demons, you can resummon them at will. Good. Alright, so let's just say real quick. Uh, yeah, we'll save over that. Let's register what we have, too. Register. Duplicate demons. Let's get... Hmm. Do I, want, do I want on the extra bonus or hero aid? Yeah, we'll take that one. Register those. Uh, let's start off by talking with Eo. Corpses line the platform. It seems the injured are being treated in the tent at the back. You find Eo helping Gyps agents tend to the wounded. Oh, sorry you had to come all the way out here to find me. This is horrible. That's why I felt like I had to do whatever I could. You needed me for something, right? Would you mind waiting just a bit? Take your time. Okay, good. Thanks. Io goes to put down what she was carrying and returns. Sorry for the wait. Um, has something happened? We're going to Nagoya. Oh, sorry. Hang on a moment. One female incoming. Heavy injuries. Out of the way. You her family. Please, come with us. She's critical. Mom! Mom! Please don't leave me! Mom! My mom's... gone. She sent my dad. He was injured. And now he's... dead. Why is this happening? I won't cry. I... I won't cry. But why? I just... I need 
need to know why. Why did they have to die? My family. Either shaking. Seems she's. She seems to. She, uh, she seems about to break down into tears. She's in no state to fight. Uh, sorry. You needed to talk to me. It can wait. You leave Eo to the comfort of her tears and walk away. Alright, stage two. She now joint skill crack with Xander. Normally, skills can only be cracked by the team that defeats the target. But if it is set with Xander, it can be cracked by both teams. Also, joint cracks can, joint cracks can be confirmed in the status display on the top screen. So yes, with joint skill cracks, um, if you have, so let's say I said Xander to crack a skill, both he and Eo can crack that skill. And if I said Eo to crack a skill, then both she and Xander can crack the skill. So it's pretty useful to have a lot of rank 2s, just so your main character can crack as many skills as possible. Uh, alright, let's go check on, now I'd like to do this optional battle. I would. But I don't know if I want to. <laughs> Well, actually, you know what? Let's leave a save. And... Because I want to see when the, when does that battle disappear. Because I want to go talk to Joe, too. You find Joe gazing up at the sky. Oh, hey, kid. Sorry for spacing out. I was thinking about cupcakes. Well, not really. What's wrong, Joe? Eh, it's nothing. I was just thinking about stuff. You realize how rare it is to see Joe seriously lost in thought. I need to talk to you. Hmm? What do you mean? You explain to Joe why the team needs to go to Nagoya. <laughs> Nagoya, huh? That's some hand fate stealing. Joe falls silent. He seems in no condition to fight. Is something there? Yeah... My girl's in Nagoya. Long story short, stuff happened between us, so I don't really want to be there. Uh, can't leave Daichi, though. We're meeting in Shinbashi, right? I'll be there, on time. Is that cool? I'll see you then. Thanks, man. Catch you later. You part with Joe and leave the area. Okay, good, so we can still fight Q. Let's do this. As you pass Hibia Park, you hear a strange voice. How oh, quaint! A quick quixotic crusader come to see the queue! <laughs> uh, let's check it out. <laughs> Looks like guests. Welcome! Bonjour! Bonjour. Your puns are worse than mine. They might be quirky, but bad puns always leave me quarrelsome. I'm known as Ghost Q, here to test your power. I'm through quibbling. I'm gonna kick the crap out of you. Ooh, I'm scared. Actually, why don't you try it? You qualified for my special. A one-on-one -on -one battle to the bitter end. And by one-on-one, -on -one, he means, of course, several teams of demons. Let's comments. So yeah, this battle can only be done with your main character.